Once upon a time in Mohapur village, there lived a rich man. He was very hard working, experienced and far sighted. On the basis of his hard work, he became a rich man of the village and people in the village used to respect him a lot because he never cheated on anyone, always followed the right path and became the owner of the huge wealth. With time, he became richer and richer and slowly he became old. He started getting weak with time and since he had grown weak, he used to be always sad. He started feeling that very soon he will die. He was also worried about his wealth. After all, he had earned all this with a lot of hard work and hence wanted to hand it over to the one who deserves the best. He had two sons. He decided to take test of both of them and see who is more knowledgeable. And the one who proves to be more knowledgeable and deserving, he will hand over his business to him. One day, he called both of them and gave them one rupee each and said, both of you will go to different markets and buy something with this rupee that can fill this house. And do remember, you cannot spend anything more than this one rupee. After listening to this, both the sons thought that their father has gone mad. After all, what can they buy with this one rupee and fill the entire house? They never wanted to take this rupee. But their father forced him to follow his instructions and do as he says. Father handed over the rupee to both of them and said, You guys can go now and get the work done quickly. I hope you guys will not take long and come back soon. Both the brothers took the rupee and left from home. The first guy moved around the whole market. However, he could not find anything that can fulfill his need. He searched for all the shops but did not find anything. After some time, he started feeling that his father is not fit mentally. And that is the reason he asked us to fill the house in just one rupee. He was about to give up and leave the task. But soon then, he saw a bullock cart loaded with straw. Looking at that, he thought this may be helpful, but I'm not sure how much straw I will get in one rupee. He walked up to the man and asked about the price. After some discussion, the boy was successful in buying the complete straw in one rupee. He took the car and came back home. Father was already at home. With a lot of hope, he bought the entire straw inside the house. However, he found that he was asked to fill the entire house, but he was not even able to cover some part of the floor. Father was looking at everything that was happening. When the second son left from home, he did not go to the market. Instead, he sat near the house and kept thinking that in one rupee, what is it that he can buy which can fill the house? He got an idea. He immediately went to the market and went to the candle shop. And in one rupee, he got a good bunch of candles. Taking candles in hand, he came back home and saw that his brother was standing and looking at the straw restlessly. It was about to get dark. The second son put two three candles in all the rooms and in no time the entire house filled with light. His father was very happy to see all this. He said, My son, you have proved your knowledge today. Hence, I am ready to hand over my entire wealth to you. 